Hi everyone, I hope you are all doing well. So today I'm thinking to do a reading for the couple that are in separation. So let's see, these cards I wanted to come out, admire, tested, illusion, labyrinth, and one more card. One more card, please. Oops, okay, I'm gonna take only the this one because I've seen this one and confusion okay so if the separation happened a while ago just know that there is somebody around you that they really really admire you and uh, everything about yourself um if this separation happened recently just know that this was for some of you this has been uh, a test just to kind of see how strong the feelings for each other are for some of you i feel like you were living in a, a illusion so you basically refuse to see the facts or the way this person really is um and i feel like for some of you you just feel like this whole relationship was some sort of labyrinth so there was always kind of let's say you had a, uh, a good day and then you know all of a sudden some unexpected things happen so i just feel like there was always something that happened in your relationship and for some of you you just decided to let go because it was just uh, getting a bit too much for you and that's why you know you just got really confused and i really feel like the other person is very confused as well because they don't know what happened uh why this oppression happened in case you decided to let go of this relationship but if they decided to let go just know that this person is very confused at the moment because again too many things happen but just know that this person is thinking to come forward okay let's see i want to find out zodiac sign this could be okay this could be yours aries uh this could be yours this could be your uh, persons from the past take you how it resonates okay so let's see what tarot cards have to say okay this one wanted to come out so i have the nine of wands Four of Swords, Queen of Wands, King of Swords, okay, one more card, oh, this one flipped, okay, and I have the Six of Cups, okay, so as I mentioned before, so for some of you, there has been some sort of, um, well, many fights going on in your relationship. And I just feel like this pushed you to make the decision of uh, just kind of um, separate from this person, to be honest with you, because I just feel like it was too much for you and you pretty much had enough of all these arguments all the time with this person. Um, so I feel like you were feeling very low, you know, very tired, very drained. And, you know, that was pretty much... The tip of the iceberg if i can say that with the four of uh, swords i feel like you again you felt very anxious very stressed out you, you know very overwhelmed mentally mentally exhausted so again that was another reason why you decided to break it off if this is not your situation it could be related to your person so take care how it resonates i'm picking up a different situations now um they see you as somebody who is uh, very energetic, very vivacious, usually, uh, very strong, very courageous, very, you're very passionate, you're very funny, you're very independent, very confident, you know, you're very optimistic. And um, I really feel like for some of you, this person will try to come back because, you know, they feel like, you know, you are the one for them and they have uh, such a positive uh, opinion about you that you know it's very hard for them to let you go and you could be there with somebody who is very intelligent very rational you know very logical that have some sort of power uh, it can be somebody with a high status you know it can be like a lawyer doctor somebody working in, in a school college university somebody with a high rank if i can say that you know but it's also somebody that is very honest you know but also somebody that has very um different morals or uh, to yours now for some of you i feel like there are children involved okay so i don't know if you have been married to this person or maybe this is a third party situation i'm not sure but there are children involved in here 
Um, and I feel like, you know, if there have been some sort of outside influences for some of you, so again, third party situation for some of you, uh, but uh, I feel like, just as I mentioned before, this person wants to come forward because they do see you as, you know, the one for them. So if uh, there are no children involved in your situation uh, or there's no third party involved in here, just know that this person wants to come forward because they see you as the one and they want to take your relationship one step high as, you know, to have children with you, get married and all these lovely things. So I'm just going to, you know, see action. So what can you expect in your future to happen. I mean, I know this is what they're thinking to come forward, but are they actually going to do this step or take that action? Let's see. So what can you expect to happen? Okay. So I have the Four of Cups in reverse. And one more card, please. Okay, I have three cards. Okay, I have Six of Swords in reverse and I have... The Seven of Swords in reverse. Uh, okay, so just as I mentioned before, this person is thinking about coming forward and they will come forward for some of you because they're going to let go of regret. They're going to... Um, I just feel like they... Um, kind of waiting for the right time, but they will definitely come forward. As soon as they feel that is the right time to come forward, they will come forward and they're just going to, because they want to kind of end this uh, situation, you know, they're going to let go of regrets and they just want to make sure they are going to work on this situation. They're going to give you a relationship. They're going to give you everything that you need because they really want to make things work with you. But just as I mentioned before, they will uh, come when the... the water is calm if i can say that and for some of you they are not going to come back because um they just feel like they really mess it up too badly and they just don't have the courage and for some of you yes they will come but i feel like you're not going to take them back because if they're coming back it's not for the right reasons i feel like it's just going to be pretty much the same cycle as before and this person has not changed so again take as it resonates i'm picking up different situations and with the seven of swords in reverse i feel like for some of you this person they will confess something to you you know they will come clean and they will try their best to come forward and just make things work 100% they will try their best, okay? So just as I mentioned before, they can have a resonance. So for some of you, yes, this person will come forward. They're going to try their best to put all the work in here, make things work with you. And some of you, yes, you will take them back. Uh, but some of you, no, you're not going to take them back because you will feel that this person has not changed. And if they're coming back, it's going to be just the same cycle as before. So this is all I'm seeing here. I really hope this reading helped. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you soon in another video. Bye.